Cristiano Ronaldo and says Portugal are not satisfied simply with qualifying for the 2022 World Cup to be held in Qatar later this year and will aim for so much more this winter. The 37-year-old forward will appear in his fifth World Cup this winter after two goals from Manchester United teammate Bruno Fernandes secured Portugal's place in the tournament with a victory against North Macedonia in the final playoff qualifier. The former Real Madrid star hailed Portugal's win, declaring that they are now in their rightful place after fears that they could miss out on the tournament due to the unpredictable nature of World Cup qualifiers. With this ticket to the show, Portugal make their fifth World Cup with Cristiano Ronaldo, leading the group. Prior to the years of CR7, Portugal had only made it to the World Cup in three occasions, ever. According to CR7 himself in a separate post on Instagram, Ronaldo insists that his personal desire to win will be much greater in Qatar than it was when he first represented his country in 2003. Ronaldo wrote, There are many ways to reach the desired destination. Sometimes a path may not be as direct as what we wanted, but the most important thing is to get there. On a personal note, I am going to my fifth World Cup and my 12th finals of a great international competition for Portugal. With the same enthusiasm as the first day, but with a much stronger ambition. An ambition to meet the desire of us all. The desire to win, El Bicho said. For now, we can smile with the feeling of accomplishment, of another stage resolved. But we don't want to stop here. We want more. We want so much more for us, for our fans, for Portugal, towards Qatar, he concluded. The Manchester United superstar will also have personal milestones on his mind as well as the hope of winning the World Cup trophy for the first time in his lifetime. A fifth World Cup will see him join the most appearances at this specific tournament alongside Germany legend Lothar Mateus and ex-Mexico players Antonio Tota Carvajal and Rafa Marquez. El Comandante could even surpass the trio if he is able to play for his country at the 2026 World Cup when he's at the age of 41. But that's just speculation at this point. At this upcoming tournament, he can even overtake former Ghana captain Asamoah Gyan as the player to score in the most consecutive major tournaments which is very likely to happen if we're being honest. The truth is, this tournament will be extra special for CR7, as it could be his last chance to chase World Cup glory. Just like Lionel Messi, Cristiano Ronaldo has only been able to dream of the opportunity to win it all. The highest level of success for both is the Regional Cup, meaning Copa America for La Luis Celeste and the Euros for Portugal. Could Qatar finally be the one? What do you think of Cristiano Ronaldo's national team legacy? We'll read you in the comments. And in the meantime, don't forget to like and subscribe.